Yep, 79.27. I checked that one up this morning. Hi, George. Hi, Ethan. How's it going? It's going good. I checked this bus and it was on here today. Okay. I checked on the transit website. Yeah. I'm like, I checked the schedule. I was like, George is going to get that one. Yeah, no. that's it. How's it going today? It's going really good. Chilly. <laughs> How is this bus been treating you? It's been treating me really good. The only thing I don't like is turns a little stiff, just like, not a big deal, but it would be nice if it was just a little bit looser. This is an early one. You don't get those early ones. Oh, that's right. What is it? 79.27? No, I don't. Not very often. And then the other 12 is 77.83. That's right. Yeah, that's the one that I don't Man, we got a big storm coming. Did oh, you hear? I tell ya. Not, uh, not so much in Calgary, we're going to get something, but Southern Alberta, whoa, they got a storm warning on the uh, TV already, a bad storm warning, and Saskatchewan, whoa, -ho -ho. who knows, it might come and hit us, eh, uh, we're going to get a solid dump, that's for sure, not that bad though, not like Southern Alberta, who knows, well, they're, that's what they're saying on the Weather Channel, like Southern Alberta. Literally, they're naming all the small towns. Red Deer is going to get it bad. Um, yeah, probably some, but really they're, they're saying Southern Alberta, literally. And Saskatchewan. Whoa, man. Well, Saskatchewan's going to get hit hard. Depending how long it lasts, they might have to shut down the schools if yeah. it's bad enough. Yeah. Well, Southern Alberta. Boy, the town is the big word. Oh, man. Fort McLeod, Clarence Home, everything down that way. Didn't get home till 9 30 again last night. Wow. Oh, do you see there's a white 77 on 11 today? That's right, yes. 81. Yeah, that's right. I like their original color. Yeah. Thank you. So we went and picked up a really nice used vehicle last night for my wife. It's beautiful. What is that? It's a 2011 Ford Escape. 98,000 kilometers on it. But yet it's 12 years old, but it operates off. Yeah, 10 years actually. Uh, 2011, yeah, 10 years. Yeah. Uh, would have been brand new in the fall of 2010. What color is it? It's black. But she is a hairdresser from a home, so she hardly ever drove it. But the average is, uh, the average is 20,000 kilometers a year for this one only has uh, about just about 9,000 kilometers. How about this bus right here, right? I wonder how many kilometers it has on it. So not rebuild time yet, eh? Uh, well, well, this one, yeah, it would be. It would have to have already been rebuilt. Yeah. If not twice, once. Well, it's a 2005. So, yeah, we've probably been rebuilding those times. Yeah. It's years. Oh, right, because the 77s, right? They've been rebuilt quite a few times. Yeah. So, they'll build the bus four times if it's in really good condition. 
rebuild the motor in it. 7841, that's got to be my favorite 78 in the fleet now that I think of it. What a nice box. You finally got another 79 after three days of not getting one. Yeah, that's right. I'm not reading this right. Something's not right. Uh, let's see. Oh, point two. So 229,869. Okay, that's better. Yeah. So 230,000 almost. Yeah. So we're probably rebuilt already. Most likely. Football weekend for you? Football weekend for you? Uh, yes, that's right. Yeah, the Bears are playing. Uh, well, no, I can't remember. Uh, you see, the 49ers are 4-4 four and four now? Yeah, they lost. Like, Green Bay is such a good team. Yeah. But, I mean, they don't have Jimmy Garoppolo at the moment. No, that's right. They got some injuries. That's probably why. Oh, they're an injury pro. George Kittle is out. Oh, okay. You know their top receiver? Right. He's out, then they got a couple more injuries. Well, there you go. That's not bad. So you're having to rely on guys off of the practice squad. That's right. Well, I'm hoping the Bears win this weekend. Yeah, you're very welcome. Say hi to your mom and your brother. For sure. Thanks. Oh, 52 stops here, eh? Uh, yes, it does. And then it turns right here. Right? Hey, I got on one of Calgary's oldest Chevy bus yesterday. Wow. Third oldest. Wow. 1826, 2013. Wow. That's old for a shuttle bus. I mean, it's like, oh, it's only seven years old, but for a little shuttle, that's a super old well, that one. Is. That is, on a small motor, all those miles. Right. Man, them, 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 all them diesel motors you guys have in the buses, though, are so good. Everything. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, the steering's a little stiff on this one. Quite a bit, actually. Happy to get her, though, I imagine. Yeah, yeah no, I'm comfortable. The mirrors are good. Everything's good. What do you mean by stiff steering? Is when you turn in, you can't get it to go? Uh, no, um, just about anything. Uh, like right now, uh, even driving straight, you can feel you can have a little bit of pull, but it's Have you driven some of the really late 77s, like 97 or whatever? Uh, yes. Mostly, they would be uh, the 60s and 70s, about 95%. But yes, I have driven a 7, 79, 97, I've driven a few buses like that. Yeah. Mostly the 60s and 70s. 79, 64, 79, 65. But have you driven 77, 97, eh? Hey, uh, I believe I have. That's not a bad boss. No. No, those 70, some of those 77 are good. 7731 was bad on takeoff, eh? Hey? Oh, okay. Remember, you would take off and you couldn't, you know. Yeah, that's right. Really good motor in it, though, I would have to say. All these buses do. Yeah. This one's got some takeoff. Uh, yeah, no, this is good. It's a, it's a good 7900 series. I think what they did, they did some work on it. This steering is really stiff. Like, see, I'm, look at that. I can't go with the steering wheel. Look how straight it is. 
So that means it's fresh after being worked on. Yeah, that's right. It's, uh, I don't care for it. This so you know the buses more than I do. How do they rebuild the motor? Do they go inside the compartment? Uh, spring guard. Hi. Is that why they keep all their parts? Um, I believe so. I know Spring Gardens is equipped to rebuild motors. Um, Anderson used to be, but once they closed it, the bus was built. There's no old fours on here today. No, no, there isn't. You think there would be? Yeah, that's right. They're not even being used a single one, I checked. Wow. It's gonna get real nippy tonight, though. It is. Yeah, that 2011 Ford Escape is about it. It's in beautiful condition. I just have a feeling the weather's still gonna be crappy here tomorrow. We're oh, not gonna be out of the woods. No, that's right. A bit of snow doesn't mean they're right. We could get a whole bunch. Yeah. From what I'm seeing, we will. Uh, we we could get quite a bit. Yeah, that's right. We haven't had one for a while, no, so... No, that's right. Thank you. You're very welcome. This motor sounds quite a bit different than 7841 yesterday. That's right. There's um 45 gonna pass you, 7745. There it is, huh? That one's not too bad. You've driven it, I guess. Yes. I got it on Route 402 Silverado once. Oh, okay, yeah, that sounds about right. So where did they take all these buses? I guess for when and they closed Anderson, I guess they split the buses up between Big Park. Because you wouldn't take them in Stony Trill, that's all where your natural gas. That's right. Your Novus instead. Yeah. You have driven one Nova. Yes. How was that one? You probably couldn't get it going, eh? The power on it? Yeah. Thank you. You're very welcome. Bye bye. It's been a long, hard fought week for me. Done lots this week. Yeah. Maybe it'll be nice to stay in tomorrow. Yeah, but yeah. So the shuttles run this route on the weekend, right? Oh, uh, yes, that's right. Are these 79s even out on the weekend? I imagine a few are. Which ones? 70, uh, 7900s, I imagine they are for like Max Teal and Max Purple and stuff. Yeah, probably, and that I wouldn't know, I'm on the south end but probably. 7947 is on MP today, I don't know if you've driven that one. Uh, no, I'm not sure. You've driven a few, quite a few of these, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, almost all the 7900s. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye. They repair brakes and stuff, too, at Spring Gardens, I oh, yeah. imagine. Absolutely. Oh, they do everything there. Reach harder and stuff. That's right, yeah. Have you ever had your retarder broke break down on you? Uh, yes. It's not that I had it break down when I took over a bus a few times. It just wasn't there, period. Would the brake start smelling then? No, no. No, there's no problem there. You just don't have... When you take your foot off the brake, it just wouldn't slow down, that's all. Oh, yeah. Once I was on 77.33 and the brakes started smelling. Wow. 
Not a lot, but the retarder was broken on it. But once it got going, the brakes cooled off, right? Right. Imagine if you got 7941 today after getting 7841, two 41s in a row. Then when you come back on Monday, 7, 77, 41, all three generations. Wow. Wouldn't that be something? You're pretty empty at the moment. Uh, yeah, that's the way. That's why it's of no value to try to help me out when I've got a full load because it, they're only on for not even 15 minutes, about 12 minutes and then I'm empty. So there's really not much... So you didn't get a big load today. Remember a month... Remember almost two months back when you had 7783, you pulled in at 230 and just got loads of people. Yeah. On Fridays, it's usually a fish for 330. Generally speaking, I don't know about today, we'll see, but next week I only work Monday, Tuesday, and then I have Wednesday off, and then I work Thursday, Friday. Why are you having Wednesday off? Oh yeah, Remembrance Day. Yes, that's it. Oh yeah. Yeah, so no work. No work for me either. I gotta get on that. Right. A lot of the shuttle operators will be out then, right? Uh, they, yes, that's right. They will. 24.03 for this bus? Uh, that's right, yeah. What a beautiful bus. What, man, you had that 78. I thought you weren't going to like it. I was like, will he like this one? No, no, that one yesterday was so nice to drive. And guess who passed you when you were picking up that girl? Who? Um, 78.42 passed oh, you. okay. You probably haven't driven that one. Forty-two. Yeah. Yeah. No, that one I have. Oh. Okay. Yeah. You've driven every series in the bus. That's right. Almost every bus. I don't remember seventy-nine thirty. Oh, maybe once. I might have driven it once. Hi. Hello. Good to see you. Man, yeah, I can tell something's coming in, George. Yes, you can. Just by the wind. Did you notice they got a new bus shelter at uh, Walmart? No, no, I didn't. Yeah. When did they put that in? Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, what's today? Friday, so Wednesday. What did they do to it? Well, you installed the post and then you put it in the glass and put it all together. Okay. Yeah, putting those posts into the concrete, that's the big thing. It got wiped out by a vehicle. Of course, yeah. Did you have to do that Vanister Road again thing? Deal with that? Did I have to do what? The Vanister Road thing uh, again? Yeah, was that yesterday? Uh, it wasn't bad. I was able to pull up in the line and only sit there about three or four minutes and then move to the right. Once I got ahead of the last part of the car, I could move to the right and go past it. How about today? Good. Because I was sitting waiting for you at Fish Creek. You pulled in at 5.30 and I and I thought so. I'm like, it's that darn Bannister Road. Yeah, that's right. So 
Sometimes the doors can be weird on the 79s, eh? Yeah, they true. open and close. Yeah. Like they can kind of be cranky sometimes. That's right. So you got to see the 79s when they were brand new. Oh yeah, absolutely. Did you have any problems with them at first since they were brand new? Uh, no, actually we didn't. They were, they were good right from the beginning. They were from Winterpeg. That's right. Yeah. I hear Manitoba's gonna get this. Oh, okay. Two. Wow. Some of it, yeah. Okay, that's interesting. Were those some of the Catholic kids? Uh, where? Uh, when you pulled into Fish Creek? Uh, I'm not sure if they were or not. They might have been Centennial. Uh, yeah, that's right. I'm going to Shaughnessy with you. Okay, great. So you don't get a load at 4.30 today? Uh, not 4.30. Uh, generally speaking, it'll be 3.30. So if I wanted to hop on a little earlier, I'm welcome to. Yeah. The reason why I do 5 o'clock during the week is because... You know, I know you're gonna get that fully loaded bus, right? So, 3.30 today seems about right. Yeah, every Friday. Everyone gets out early. That's right, yes they do. You don't get much of a layo, um, a break here at Somerset, eh? No, that's How is, um, oh, I wanted to ask you, I feel like you told me this before, what was wrong with the 500 series? Why weren't they a good bus? I can't remember what you told me. The 500 series? Yeah. Oh, man, boy, I gotta tell you, I don't know. Well, everything was wrong with the headlights were about pretty quick. Oh, man, you can turn that steering wheel left or right about 20 feet to There's, the um, what is that, uh, 7721 ahead of us. Oh, yeah, right. They buy a uh, when that's crazy. <laughs> what I hate when you're late, you get delayed by the trains by a few minutes. Yeah. 
I know. That, I know. I shook my head. I looked at my wife. I said, are you kidding me? First time he buys a ticket. How nice is that? I wonder if it was his old numbers or if he just bought it quickly. Yeah, that's a good question. Yeah. Because you know in Quebec and Ontario, on the Lotto Max, they're allowed to pick. If they want to, they can pick all three lines for five dollars. Their own no numbers. Way. That's why they win all of them. Yeah, that's what somebody else says. That's, that's true. Not like us. No, <laughs> that would cost us fifteen dollars. George, I'm surprised you haven't driven seventy nine thirty. Yeah, I don't recall driving it. To be quite honest with you, I might have once, but. I just can't remember if I did. Like if I did, it would only be once. Uh, boy, I never got that one. I don't think I did. Most like I say, about 95% of the time it would be 7964, 7965, 7967, 7977, 7979, 7978. All those buses. You haven't driven them for a while. Uh, no. Um, it's been probably a month or two since I've had 79.65. About two months. You had 62 once. I was on. I was on with you in that one. Right. And 79.77 and 79.79. I had not too long ago. But 81, that was a nice bus. Yeah. Oh, there's your Nova. There it is. They're having a lot on the 167 routes now, all the time. All the time. Yeah. But you never get a chance to do that one because you're station to station. Pay forty or fifty bucks. I don't think he'd be too happy. Oh, I don't think so either. Yeah. No. You get in and he turns the fan off right there. I'm just going about a hundred feet. Oh my god. Oh, that's funny. It would be. Well, that's what I they did in that in that movie Airplane. Oh, yeah. yeah. The guy took the cab to the airport and he jumped out and ran because he needed to catch that plane his girlfriend was on. At the end of the movie. They showed the cab was still there at the airport, and it was like two million dollars on it. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, it was That's just a, a comedy. I never heard that one. Yeah, it was a funny movie. Uh, yeah, the cab was still there at the end of the movie, and it had like two million dollars he owed on it. <laughs> that was oh, that was a good movie. Did he end up catching a plane? Right, he did. Yeah. That's what it was all about. Oh, that was a great movie. Can you imagine if he had to pay that half price? Oh, yeah. Everybody was in that. All the, all the big stars. Oh, man. Oh, Leslie Nielsen was in that. He was so funny. Thank you. You're welcome. Gonna do the 11. Haven't done that one in a while. No, that's right. When does the next 11 show up after you pull out? Hey? Uh, yeah. Let's see. The next 11? Yeah. It'll be at 18. So 10... About 14 minutes. 18 minutes from now. Yeah. So by the time I get there, it'll be about uh, maybe just under 12, around 12 minutes. And then I'm going to do my best to try to catch 81 today. 81 at Canyon Meadows? Or does it still go to Canyon Meadows? No. 81, 77, 81. Oh, wait. not Route 81. Oh, okay. <laughs> 
Route 81 is McLeod Trail North. Yeah. Right, right. That's right. They actually have a diesel bus on there today. Right. 1800. Just yeah, so when you say 81, it just sounds like a route, not a. I gotta give you the description of the bus. Oh, you're you're teasing me, ain't you? <laughs> what does that mean there? Willy Wonka's Willy Wonka's a burger truck. I just don't understand what that's like. Willy Wonka's a burger truck. So if I Yeah, thanks. So Hey, did you win that million? Oh sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ha Have a good day. Oh wow. Yeah, so if I catch 70, uh, 781, does he leave before you pull back into Somerset? Uh, well, what route is it? It's 11. Well, why don't you just catch it at Shaughnessy? Yeah. You're only going to be about 10 minutes. Yeah. yeah. But I'm saying if I were to catch the particular bus later on, does he, does Jer, uh, Gary, pull out before you go back to Somerset, or? Well, he's in, he's out of Shaughnessy at eighteen and forty-eight. He's out of the Bridlewood Station at twenty-six and fifty-six. Okay. Thanks for giving me bus schedules. That way, I know. That's right. You meet the 11 all the... Uh, you've done that one before, right? Which one? The 11? Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I've done every bus out here. I haven't done the one to Comperfield. The one Did they ever have Jimmy's on the 11 back then, yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they did years ago, yeah. Because I've been driving out here for about 15 years. So, yeah, they had Jimmy's for a while. They weren't many last day later on. Well, the Jimmy's they had actually were out of Anderson before this opened up. That's right, too. Yeah. Once this opened up, then we were getting into the most for They say you, um, they say, um, um, you guys always got the crappy buses at Anderson. That's right. Except the Jimmy's and MCI's, they weren't crappy. No, no. When the 79s came in, where did they go? Uh, probably BP, likely. Yeah. We got the 7500s. Oh, wow. Just terrible. Well, I drove one to the city dump and they refused it. They said they only take garbage there. This was worse than garbage. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I like to say that, though. Oh, they were bad. Whoa. Do you say the body on them are bad too? Well, everything about them. You had no heat on the driver's feet. On the whole, and even the heat on the windshield was terrible in the winter. It wouldn't. It wasn't very good. So you had trouble keeping the windshield clear. Just everything about them. They were terrible. The brakes were bad. There was nothing good about them. We just got them after they had been used across the city, as usual, and they were just, whoa, they're breaking down, whoa. How about the 76s? They were a lot better. Um, uh, yeah, somewhat. They were okay. They were better. But These were the nice girls all back then. Yeah. These ones. What you got into the 77s? You know what some of the drivers said about the 77s recently, though? What? They should put them out of their misery. Oh, okay. Yeah, they don't like... Some of them don't like the 77s. Right. No, no, a lot of drivers have a preference. Yeah. And I can understand that. Yeah. They talk a lot about the 79s. Yeah, well, these have always been a good bus. 
just unfortunate the steering is a little stiff. Other than that, this is great. Not shaky either. No, no, this is okay, but there's just something left. So on you're not head. getting a loaded bus at 4:30. So if I would like to, I could hop back on right. earlier today, yeah. right? Later today. Yeah. Good. Because if there is, I want to avoid the... Well, you get it at 3.30 an hour earlier. That's right, just on Friday. There's a 79, by the way. Yeah, there are 79.37. I, I have that bus on my channel. Oh, okay. I meant to go there last night to that channel you have, and I was just too busy again. All right. Subscribe, George. Oh, you have to subscribe to it? Yeah, that way you can get my... Oh, how do you subscribe? What does that mean? Uh, I would have to show you sometime. <laughs> oh, you can't just go there? Click the bell button. No, the... Right. The bell bottom? Uh, oh, the bell at the bottom? For over a year, and not. Absolutely yes. not. Okay. Oh, okay. And then we're, has, uh, does that take me to his yeah. site? Oh, okay, good. All right. Uh, I'll see you. I'll see you. I'll be back on in a few hours. Okay, you take care. Bye. Bye.